If you've ever been in a creative funk or just drawing blanks creatively, Leonardo AI has come up with a solution for that, which is called flow state. Now the way this works is super simple. Log into Leonardo.ai, go into image creation. You should now see an option here called flow state. We'll click on that. And for paid users for a limited time, flow state is unlimited generations. After that, it'll be one token per image generated. Now, if we take a look at the user interface, you see that we're in flow state mode or style options here. Leave it on automatic for now. Then you can select your dimensions. There's a prompt enhance option here. So simple prompts will do and then private mode. So let's try something very simple in general. And I'm just going to put in anthropomorphic raccoon wearing street clothes walking in the city at night. For those of you that know me, you know I love my anthropomorphic animals. Let's go ahead and click generate. And what's cool about this, it's going to give you a wide range of styles. And as you see here, I'm scrolling down and it's continually producing all these images. Now, I'm not sure because it's unlimited right now if this is going to be forever, but it's a great way to start with a simple prompt and take a look at the images for a style that you'd want to use as a basis, right? So I kind of like the way this is looking. And when you like a style, you can click on more like this. And when you hover over more like this, it'll tell you the styles that it used. So vibe, we have tattoo, shot type, cute. And you could later enter those styles here manually if you wanted to. But for now, let's click on more like this. And as you could see with the new generations, they're all consistent in its style. So it's kind of like using a reference image. And I will say this is super fast. So I'm wondering if it's like an LCM model. The previewing is very quick. So if I scroll down here, we're going to get more generations in just a few seconds. There we go. You'll also notice at the top here, there's a history. So you can go back and see the prompt that was created. And it tells you the other information at the bottom here. You also notice that you have a save feature here so I can save this to my library. You can download it directly, upscale. And if we click on the three dots, you see that these options are not available just yet, but coming soon. And you can also click on the image and get your usual options here. Now at any time we could change these styles. So under style, let's click on vibe. There's so many options here, color sketch, tattoo, logo, bronze. Let's try sci-fi here and let's go change the lighting. Let's try mystical shot type. Let's select spiritual here, kind of goes with mystical and color theme. I think color theme, we'll just leave it on automatic and let's change the aspect ratio to two by three and generate those. Very, very cool. I really like this aesthetic. And I will say once again, it generates very quickly. Oh, I like this black and white version. Very cool. Ah, this one looks cool. Let's click on more like this. It really honors and keeps the original style, which is very, very good. And I'll probably do another video on this later, but I suspect that you can do some consistent character creation with this to a point. Probably you'd need some post-production, but yeah, this is fantastic. I mean, it works well. The quality is good. There's so many styles that you can try out here. So awesome, awesome addition by Leonardo AI. Let's try one more. We're going to put this back on automatic. Actually, let's do something more photorealistic. Yeah, street photo and motion. We're going to enter this prompt concept sports car with body kit speeding down a mountain road. Uh, actually, let's also make this 16 by 9. Let's click on generate. Nice, nice. This one looks really cool. Love the colors. Definitely see the motion. This one has a cool perspective. Very photorealistic and cinematic as well. I uh, really like this effect. Very impressed so far. It's making the creative process much easier. And the good thing is, is that it supplies the prompt. So you can take that prompt, tweak it, make adjustments, change the style. Whoa, he's about to hit this car here. Better get in the other lane. So that's Leonardo AI's flow state. I'll do a follow up video on how we can utilize this for other workflows. As always, my friends, let me know what you think in the comments below. I'll see you when I see you.